Some of us have experienced others being really hard on us. Some of us have learned to be really hard on ourselves. Some of us have experienced really difficult situations in life that have caused us to harden. This can take a toll on ourselves, our bodies, our health, and our relationships. But what if there's another way? What would life be like? How would our bodies feel? How would our relationships blossom if we learn to be more gentle? In the following guided meditation, we will explore the root cause of where these patterns are coming from so that we can gain greater awareness around them and intentionally choose a different way of being, a more gentle way of being. Hello and welcome to today's guided meditation. My name is Jeannie and we're just going to go ahead and get started. So I'm going to invite you to find a comfortable position. And whenever you're ready, you can gently close your eyes. If you feel like shaking anything off, I'm going to invite you to take a few moments to do so. Maybe you feel like rolling your neck a little bit, or brushing a few things off your shoulders, and pulling them back a bit to open up your heart space a little. And if you don't feel like moving much, that's okay too. Now we're going to invite some stillness into your body by first gently bringing your awareness to your breath. And just notice what it's doing. You don't have to do anything to change it. Notice if it's shallow or deep. Feel how your body rises and falls after each breath. And see if you can give yourself permission to breathe in just a little bit deeper all the way into your belly or whatever feels comfortable in this moment is just perfect now take a deep breath in and with a big exhale you can release anything that is no longer serving you now gently bring your awareness to the surface your body is resting on Feel how the surface is supporting you without you needing to do anything. Feel how your body makes contact with the surface. And see if you can give your body permission to let go and sink deeper and deeper onto the surface. Fully knowing and trusting that you are fully supported. What would it feel like if your body could melt just a little bit more? onto the surface and just allow yourself to be fully supported. Now gently notice the temperature in the room. Notice if your skin feels hot, warm, or cold. Now gently bring your awareness back to your breath and allow it to find its natural rhythm Whatever that looks like, whatever that feels like, is just perfect. Next, you're going to let your body know that you're here to connect with it, to get to know it better, to create more awareness around what it might be needing, wanting, asking for. We will be going within to tap into the answers that have been inside of you all along. We're going to ask any and all thoughts to take a seat and observe in silence. We're about to take a journey within, and we'd like their full attention and cooperation. When we're done, we're going to invite our thoughts back into the process to actively participate. But for now, we ask that they just observe. This is a safe space. We're not here to judge, shame, or criticize. We're just here to gather information. There are no wrong answers. Any information will be allowed, accepted, and embraced. From this point forward, 
we're going to invite and allow your intuition to fully take over so there's no need to second guess any answers you receive whatever you get will be just perfect it is safe to trust yourself you will see hear sense and feel only what your system feels safe and ready to process you can always come back for more information whenever you feel ready for a deeper layer to be revealed to you. There is no rush and there is no pressure. Now we're gently going to tune in to the energy of being hard on yourself. And as you tune into this pattern or energy of being hard on yourself, gently scan your body from head to toe and notice if any sensations are present. If your body has been holding this energy of being hard on yourself, where in your body is it located or being stored? Now as you bring your awareness to this location, gently notice what it feels like. Is it a big energy or a small one? Next, we're going to start to ask a few questions that will give us greater insights as to what's been going on internally so that we can explore what is asking to be healed so that we can step into a more empowering state as we go through life. With your awareness at this location your body guided you to, the first question is, if the energy located in this area had a color, what color or colors do you get? If this energy had a shape or a visual, what shape or visual do you get? If this energy had a number, what number do you get? And it's okay if you get just one number or more than one. If you got more than one number, you can intuitively pick the number that draws your attention the most. Now, if this energy could do anything it wanted, and it wouldn't get in trouble, what does it want to do? Now, for the next question, we're going to go just a little bit deeper, and we're going to ask, if this energy contained a memory inside of it, what memory does it give you? Once you have this memory, you're gently going to take a few mental notes of what just happened. Notice who's there. Notice how this part of you looks. How do they feel? Now you're gently going to hold in your mind's eye a clear picture of what you look like when this memory took place. And I'm going to invite you to pull them out of you. And as you pull them out of you, notice where they want to be in relation to you. Are they standing far away, close by? Did they come up to you and crawl into your arms? Wherever they feel comfortable being is just perfect. This is a part of you that has probably been waiting for you for a really long time. So take a few moments to say to them, I'm so sorry you've been waiting for so long. I'm here now. I see you. I feel you. I'm ready to listen. You are important to me. You matter. Your needs, feelings, wants, and desires matter to me. Now, based on the memory you're working with, gently ask them, how do you feel? What need is it being met? Based on what happened, what beliefs did you form about yourself, about others, and about life?
based on what happened, what patterns were created, and are these patterns still serving us? What would you like to experience instead? Based on the answers this part of you gives you, we're going to take a few moments to create a few compassion statements that will facilitate the healing process. I'm so sorry you learned to be so hard on yourself. I'm so sorry you weren't shown more grace. I'm so sorry they weren't gentle with you. I'm so sorry I haven't been more gentle with you. And for the next couple of phrases, you're going to fill in the blank with whatever they need to hear. I'm so sorry you believed. I'm so sorry you thought. I'm so sorry you questioned your worth, your value, your... Now as you lovingly look at this part of you, you're gently going to say to them, it's okay for you to express what you're feeling. It's safe for you to feel your feelings. I'm not here to judge, shame, or criticize you. I'm here to hold space for you, to love you, to see you, to hear you. If you feel sad, you have permission to cry. If you feel angry, you have permission to yell, stomp, or throw a tantrum. If you feel scared, it's safe to come into my arms. I will hold you until you decide to let go. I'm so sorry you've been carrying this for so long, and you're not alone anymore. I'm here with you. I'm here for you. I will protect you. I will speak for you. I am here to love you unconditionally. I am willing to be gentle with you. If any emotions come to the surface, Just allow yourself to feel them and allow them to move through you. With your breath, you can create a little more space for the feelings. And on the exhale, you can release anything that is no longer serving you. With your inhale, gather all the harshness, criticism, judgments, and anything else that comes to mind. And with your exhale, release all of it. Let it go. It's no longer serving you. And it's safe to let all of that go. One more time. With your inhale, gather all of the harshness, criticism, judgments, perfectionism, anything else that comes to mind. Gather it all up. And with your exhale, release it all of it, let it go. Whatever is no longer serving you, it's safe to let all of that go. Next, you're gently going to check in with this part of you and ask them if they believe you when you say that from this point forward, you will be there for them whenever they need. and ask if there's anything else they'd like you to know. Ask if there's anything else they'd like to hear from you. Then take a few moments to speak to them from your heart, to speak your truth to them, to share any promises you want to make to them.
and take a few moments to give them some space to tell you anything else they'd like to share with you. Lastly, thank them for taking the time to talk to you and for the opportunity to get to know them at a deeper level. You can ask them if they'd like a hug or a kiss before you go. And let them know that you look forward to spending more time with them. That they can count on you whenever they need you. Now take a few deep breaths, and whenever you're ready, you can start to wiggle your fingers and toes, and blink your eyes open. <laughs>